Hey guys, Delogic here, and today I'll be showing you guys how to make a music slash battery progress bar with a shape. So here's a quick preview of what it will look like. And um, it's just the progress bar, not the widget. The widget could be for another video. So let's get started. First, we're going to open a new preset. Load and new. Now we're going to add in an overlap group over here. Now in this overlap group, we're going to have one progress bar. And this progress bar can show the battery or the music. So for our purposes, we're going to show music. And that's pretty much it. So as you can see, the progress bar shows the music playtime. Now we can go back one and move it to the center of the screen. Center. And here you are. Now to add in the shape, let's figure that part out. So in the overlap group, we'll add a shape. All right. And we'll make the shape red so we can see it. Paint red and we'll make it a bit bigger and a circle looks nice so there you have it and now we're gonna modify the position but first we need to know the length of the progress bar so we'll go back go to progress and we'll see here that the length is 300 okay so we'll keep that in mind now we'll go to circle again whoops and we'll go to position Anchor, oh, oh, I'm making mistakes. We're anchor it and the center left. So it's on the left side, which is zero. And we'll modify the left padding with some code. So we'll click over here, add in code. And we'll click on it again. And we're gonna go to the music info and get the music track position as a percentage. And we'll times this by three and we're timesing it by three because the length of the progress bar is 300 pixels so times three if it was 400 pixels you'll do times four if it's like 540 you'll do times times 5.4 and it's just because you get music info as a percentage so we're gonna do percentage of the length all right and click check mark and there you have it a shape following the music progress bar. If you guys are having trouble seeing it, just open your music app and click play and then adjust the time of the music. If you have any more questions, um, leave a comment below and I'll reply to all of them. Anyways, thank you guys for watching and I really really hope you guys find these videos useful. Um, if you guys have any suggestions for new videos, please leave a comment below. I will reply to them and I will take it into consideration. So, I'll see you guys next time.